Good morning and welcome again to sit down with Father John. Next week is going to be a tremendous busy week in the parish. But before I get there, we start with this Sunday, the day before the Feast of St. Vincent of Paul, which is on Monday. We have the members of the St. Vincent of Paul Society being commissioned again at the 10 o'clock Mass. Some members of the Vincent Paul Society will be telling you about the society and inviting you to become members of the society. Remember, to follow the society is a calling. It's a calling that out of our faith in Jesus Christ, we are called to serve the poor. We don't serve the poor to come holy and serve our holiness. We are called to serve the poor because we see Christ in the poor, but most of all, the poor must see Christ in us. Next Friday is the 1st of October, the beginning of the month of Our Lady. And this year we are privileged to have Bishop Park celebrate on the first, the first Friday, the first Friday of the month of Our Lady, he will celebrate Mass of Our Lady. And also after the Mass, before the Mass, he will unveil the new statue, Our Lady of Armor of Hope. And this is conjunction with the first Friday of Our Lady of Fatima, one heart, one soul. And our retreat this week is this Friday is called One Heart, One Family. That everybody goes to Jesus through Mary. So one Mary, one family, we go to Jesus through Mary. Saturday, the second, is the first Saturday month, and we have our first Saturday month in, in honor of Mary, the back of the heart of Mary, with Mass at 10 o'clock, preceded by adoration at 8 a.m. So it's the second, adoration is as of 8, followed by Mass at 10. And Friday, the Bishop will be celebrating Mass at 10, and following him, there will be retreat to 3.30. Also the second, being the first Saturday, is two days before the Feast of St. Francis, which is on, on Monday the 4th, but Father Bill will bless the animals on the 2nd of October at 11 o'clock after the Mass, and we hope that you bring all your animals, cats and dogs, fish, whatever you have, they're all welcome for the blessing of animals. Sunday, the territories is busy. Sunday, next Sunday, not this Sunday, next Sunday, we will start in the courtyard at 9 30 with the children of faith formation to recite the rosary for life. Because we're in the 40 days of, of, of praying for the gift of life, that life is from the moment of conception to the moment of death, and this is the 40 days we pray for. And the bishop has asked us, I saw our children on the third at 9 30, we'll be reciting the rosary before the family mass of faith formation at 10 o'clock. That's the third. On the night, the following Saturday, is the night when we have our first ice cream and adoration social for our families of the parish. The parish council asked me to see could we incorporate our young families in the parish. So we came up with the idea of having an ice cream social at three o'clock followed by adoration and singing and prayers for all family the young, the youth, anybody from one to a hundred are welcomed at this adoration. Ice cream at three o'clock, adoration at three thirty with music and prayers. And the parish council are really organizing a lot for that. The next thing coming up is the Native American experience, which will be on Saturday 
the 16th of October and that's going to be held at 7 o'clock in the courtyard a Native American experience Maureen Hendridge, Maureen Beebridge is preparing it so she's going to give us a great experience of what a Native American does at that at 7 o'clock on Saturday the 16th of October then on the 19th of October we have our ladies night out I told you last week you can register online and please register online or in the office because we want to get a good count of what's going to be there so I showed you where the registration is. let me get it again for you this week because some of you, you you don't know how to get on the website look you go and you go to the website there's the website St. Anne Ruskin look at it St. Anne Ruskin .org. then you go for just for fun ladies night out click on ladies night out and there you have you see place your order for ladies night out dinner boxes we attend the courtyard all there it's all there so please please sign up and so we get a good number and if you want child care we have it so if, if you have children we have don't worry about your children we have babysitters here for you're at mass and eating your children will be cared for so don't worry so if you have children we want to give you an experience of ladies night out that would start at mass at 6 30 followed by a box dinner in the courtyard for all of us to have a good time last year because of covid we had it and many people really enjoyed it so please sign up again there are just a few things happening in the parish let me see anything coming out coming up well, I have everything covered. Thank you very much. Oh, yes. And don't forget to support Bingo. Bingo is, uh, helps us as a fundraiser. We had not many fundraisers last year, but Bingo is a good fundraiser. So thank you. Now, I told you Friday, the 1st of October, Bishop Parks is coming here to say the Mass for Our Lady, beginning of October, Our Lady of, of the Rosary. Now, in the Nartex, all during the month of October, there will be rosary beads made by our parish made by our par by our rosary makers, and hopefully we may have some scapulars of Our Lady of Mount Carmel. I don't know if we many, but hopefully we will have some. And then I want you to pray to Our Lady of Mount Carmel and Our Lady of Fatima. So we say a prayer now to Our Lady as we prepare for the month of October. So let us pray in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Blessed Virgin Mary of Fatima, you, with renewed gratitude of your motherly presence, we join in voice for all generations that call you blessed. We celebrate in you the great works of God, who never tires of lowering himself in mercy over humanity, afflicted by evil, wounded by sin, to heal and to save it. Accept with your love of a mother this act of entrustment that we make in faith to you today. Before your image, beloved to us, we are certain that each one of us is precious in your eyes and that nothing in our hearts is estranged from you. May we allow your sweet gaze to reach us and the perpetual warmth of your smile. Guard your life with your embrace, bless and strengthen every desire for good. Give new life and nourishment to fate. Sustain and enlighten hope. Awake and animate in us charity. Guide us to the path of holiness. Teach us by your own special love for the little and for the poor, for the excluded and the suffering, for sinners and the wounded of heart. Gather all your people under your protection and give all, give us to your beloved Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed will thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Our Lady of Armor, Mother of Hope, pray for us. Our Lady of Fatima, pray for us. Our Lady of Lourdes, pray for us. Saint Anne, Mother of the Blessed Virgin Mary, pray for us. And let us bow our heads. So may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. We now go with God's peace. Peace. 
to serve the Lord. Oh, one thing I forgot. Faith formation. Those doing home formation. The first Wednesday of the month, which is October the 6th. You have to bring your your homework to me. That is faith formation, home school children. Bring your homework to me on Wednesday, October the 6th. More details to be in the post. Bye. Bye.